Hello for us again today, not really expected to see a lot of beautiful field mushrooms during the trip to Dingo. See the field mushroom, beautiful early season of field mushroom here in Ireland. Bigger one. Oh, shiny. Super, super beautiful. Oh, smell amazing. Mushroomy. And you see, it's the smell you expect from the field mushroom. It's so beautiful. Two of them. Let's look around. See if I can find any more. Not too far away. A small one. A bit dirty. Ah. Yeah, but still beautiful. Yeah, and I saw another one. Actually, two of them here grow in the same spot. A bit dirty. But it's totally fine. The field mushroom grow out from the earth and normally on the field. And they normally grow in circle. So if you find one, you will find few more of them at least. After collecting all of the field mushroom, I found two little cute baby lamb calling me. They actually want some food but I only have mushroom which are not suitable for them to eat Now let's go back to the field mushroom How can you identify them? First of all, you need to look at the cap of the mushroom the cap are white, are sometimes discolored to brown or a bit gray when they are mature. One important key identifier of the field mushroom is when you cut or injure the cap of the mushroom, you will see a bit of pink. The second part that you need to look is the gill of the mushroom. It's very easy and simple. The gill when young is pink, material is turned to be brown and dark brown. The field mushroom gill are always crowded. And remember, the color is always pink to brown. If you find any mushroom living in the same environment, however, have the white gill. So it's ring the bell that is not the field mushroom. Looking down at the mushroom is the stem of the mushroom is all the way white and smooth. You also can see some small side of the ring of the mushroom, but it's not very clear. And the mushroom also has a small skirt as well, but again, it's not very big and may not last very long. When you find them, you may not see them. Now the key identification of the field mushroom is the flesh of the mushroom is white and sometimes you can see some pink heat on the flesh. Last but not least important criteria is the smell of the mushroom. The field mushroom must smell mushroomy or anisey. If it smells chemical, then it's ring the bell that is not a good mushroom to eat. There is one mushroom that a lot of people always confuse with the field mushroom is yellow stainer. The same family member with the field mushroom, that's why they look quite similar. However, there's only one key identification. When you peel the cap of the mushroom, you will see a stain yellow. And also, the smell of this mushroom is awful. 
its wings smell like Indian ink, hospital, or chemical. When you smell it, you know that it's not a good mushroom to eat. This mushroom is not deadly poison. However, if you eat them, you will feel awful and sick. So be careful whenever you go out looking for mushroom. Remember all the key identification of the mushroom before you pick and eat any mushroom. Mm -hmm.